Good morning, welcome back to farm, Mini Farm SM1. So um, I just wanted to give you an update on what we've been doing here. Me and the other half had a week off of work, which meant, of course, we did nothing but work on the home, the homestead, the Mini Farm. So our pigs are still the same. There they are. Need yet another clean out, which unfortunately animals do. Um, so we've got a new table and chairs. I'm so excited. It's lovely. We haven't had table to eat at for a few years now. We just haven't had the space. So new table and chairs up. These are the newest additions, the baby quail. They are now um, coming up to two weeks old. And this one right down here in the corner is my favorite one. I can't wait to see how he turns out or she. Um, almost black with sort of the creamy markings around the eyes so it, um, interesting to see how pretty that one comes out and we've got the little mini one over here it's just tiny compared to the others and we've got one whose um, feet don't work basically they're, they're all sort of scrunched up underneath her or him um, I can't see him now hmm. yeah I don't know Maybe she's decided to get up and walk. <laughs> they all look like they're walking fine. Um, anyway, yeah, so that's the baby quail update. Um, we've got the adult quail still in the hutch, but they will be moving very soon. Um, here they are. Got some sand there. So we've got some more sand coming. So the one uh, with the white chest is definitely a boy. Um, he's been doing his call, <laughs> it's brilliant. And I believe the other one's a girl, which is perfect. So they're the only two left from the first batch of hatching. Um, my strawberries. We've had a few, we've managed to eat some and they've been really quite tasty. Right, this is Mama Rabbit. Um, we think she might be pregnant, but we're not certain. So we've moved the boy out. So her run is now all hers. There's a hutch at the back. We lock her up at night just for safety. There we are, and this is the boys' hutch in here. Um, there we go, there's the boys' call, like I said. And here is the aviary I have built for the quail. Right, from a different angle, so I'm quite excited. Um, I'm not 100% finished with it, I still want to do some more sort of connecting making sure everything is secure but there is our aviary so from the inside um, yeah, um, I am I'm very excited to get the quail in there so they can have a good run about and my little ones can go and join in <sighs> unfortunately my raspberry plants really aren't very happy but the lettuce the tomatoes my potatoes even have gone mad my tomatoes have little yellow flowers on. The garden at the end, some things are thriving, some aren't, like my carrots, they've gone wild. We've got my trees and my beans are growing very nicely up the fence there. Mint, thyme, flowers as always. And in here, I planted kale, but I appear to have a few different things growing. <laughs> so I'm not sure. So currently, I am planning my garden for next year. Um, obviously, still fixing up the uh, new aviary, so exciting, um, and yeah, still growing my plants. So that's all for now. Thank you for watching, and I will see you again soon. Bye.